Hey there, it's Sean Bailey, the Sales Funnel Nerd, and welcome to this video today. Here I'm going to show you how to take a launch funnel in QuickFunnels and use it to deliver a video lead magnet. So I'm going to show you the actual funnel steps here, and the first one is the opt-in page here. So uh, all it is is a simple opt-in page, uh, headline, video message explaining what they'll get once they go inside, and then after they opt in, it's going to take them to uh, part one. So when they land on this first page, uh, they have video number one, and they can't click on to any of the other videos in the funnel uh, because I have it set up so there's a button here that'll take them to video number two. But if you watch what happens when I reload this page, and you can see there's no button. I have it on a time delay, so it doesn't show up for, um, I believe it's like two minutes, but that gives them time to watch the video and actually, you know, if they're gonna wanna watch more, then they're gonna watch this video probably all the way till the end. And then after that, they'll click the button. Otherwise, if they click off or whatever, it doesn't matter. Uh, but once they actually watch this and go into video number two, I have it set up so that uh, the buttons show up right away and then it just takes them over to an affiliate offer for funnel scripts. And after they get into part two, uh, they're able to click on to uh, part three, part four. So it unlocks after the first page here. They just have to wait two minutes for the button to show up. And normally the video is gonna autoplay, so uh, they'll just start watching it. And then uh, if they want to learn more, go to the rest of the videos in the series, uh, then the button will say, take me to part two. So that's how you take a launch funnel and use it to deliver a video lead magnet uh, and how to do it in three parts. And the reason I did this in three parts is because I'll show you in the video here, uh, there's a particular slide. I took a classic sales funnel and just kind of broke down what they would need, what I would have to come up with if I was going to do this type of uh, classic sales funnel and all the copywriting elements I would need. And I showed them how long it would take me to do it the old way if I had to just kind of do it all myself and how fast I can do it now with funnel scripts. And to prove how fast I can do it now with funnel scripts is I actually took and created a sales funnel from scratch because one of the things I like to do when I'm not nerding out with sales funnels is go out and do some kayaking. So I actually built a sales funnel with a, a squeeze page, a VSL, and then a profit maximizer. And I did all the sales copy for it using funnel scripts uh, in the kayaking niche. So um, I did not think that I would ever be making a product for the kayaking niche, but it was kind of fun to do as far as uh, just showing off what you can do with funnel scripts. And then after I demonstrate um, each part of it underneath the videos, um, from lead generation, core offer, and profit maximizer. The buttons underneath just go over to, uh, they have my affiliate link for, for funnel scripts. But um, yeah, it was a fun way to demonstrate the actual product and show what you could do in a completely different and unrelated niche. And I was able to take a, you know, a launch funnel. And even though I wasn't doing a launch, I used it to deliver a three-part video lead magnet. ClickFunnels is just so uh, fun to work with, the things that you can do, and all you have to do is just apply a little bit of creativity. So let me know what you thought of this video. Don't forget to click like and subscribe underneath here. And uh, if you have any questions about this or funnels, shoot me a line and let me know. Other than that, I will see you in the next video. Thanks for watching. Bye-bye.